Hey, Chris Morley here. I'm just going to show you one of the new screens that I've been working on with QT VCP. It's uh, a screen that's like G a Axis, which may seem a little weird, but um, Axis is an excellent screen, and so if you can't build something as good as it, you probably need to do some work on VC uh, VC QT VCP. That and also one of the only complaints of Axis or one of the major ones, is that you can't change anything. It's very difficult to modify it. Now there has been some work to document that, but anyways, in QTVCP, of course, you can change anything you want. Anyways, this is the basic screen. And there's not a lot of surprises. <coughs> there's a few things that are, of course it's not finished, but there's a few things that are different. Um, but most of it is the same. Some of it, for instance, setting the origin here. Um, you can see it's a little bit different but you have these other options so you can set it to the last number or you can uh, divide it by two if you're coming to an edge the only difference here is this works with the current user offset and there's no way to with a button change that user offset now I probably should add a button here for that but I haven't got that far <coughs> a little program here we'll see uh, most of the same options that access has There's not all of them are there I wouldn't say the, the uh, screen is finished but uh, it's in pretty good shape. You see that uh, I did add these focus overlays to darken or color the screen when dialogues come up. Uh, this word on the bottom is optional. The colors optional. You can actually superimpose a watercolor or, or picture, if you will, on the background. Those are all options. Um, it's just to bring your attention that the dialogue needs to be answered before anything else. Everything else works pretty much the same as you'd expect. One thing is, is uh, if you change the size or location of the screen, It remembers this so that the next time you run it, it will open and uh, the same size and location. And the dialogues, uh, the dialogues have that option too, <coughs> or the dialogues can be made so they always uh, open in the same spot. That's all options in the preference file. Anyways, that is G axis. No, that's uh, QT G, <laughs> QT axis. I was confusing it with my G screen uh, infrastructure. <laughs>